so I reached out to Akko. I wanted to get the clear story because if it was true, then this keyboard's even better than I thought, and it is true. So I, this is the only three pen that I had handy. This is a, um, a Franken switch. It has the uh, cream, a cream stem with the uh, body of a silver um, and, the, and the spring of the silver, C Akko CS silver. So when or if you want to use one or more three pin switches mixed with your magnetic switches, what you do is you go ahead and place the switch. You go to Akko's website and you download the latest version of the Akko cloud driver. It should say magnetic um, switch or uh, HE or something like that, but it's the latest version. Once you get it installed, and you open it up, you want to gonna, you're gonna want to go to the about section, and you're gonna want to go to the, it's the top, the bottom, um, right hand side. It's gonna say calibration. It's gonna press a button. It's gonna spin for a second, give you a message. Then in red text, it's gonna go over and say, now press each key in sequence. That's where I kind of got lost. But even if you're changing out only one switch. Um, like I just did right there, you put it into calibration mode and when it's that red text that, say, that says press every key in sequence, you literally want to go through and you want to make sure that you press them all the way. Um, obviously don't beat on it, but start with the escape. And this is the way that I did it. I think that they just really want every key to be pressed, but it's easier to do it obviously if you do it in sequence to not get lost. But just start with the escape key, make sure that you're hitting every key once and only once and go through and make sure that they're fully actuating and then once you do that you press continue it'll spin again for a little bit and then now that switch that particular it I, I don't know how you know whatever it does internally it's switching to allow communication from whatever switches have three pin switches in there and they work just fine. And I've done it with a couple different switches. It, it doesn't care as long as you go through the calibration process, right? And I haven't done it wrong once, but I do strike it pretty hard. Um, and you can mix. So this to me, this is a game changer. I, I had no idea about this before uh, this was sent out to me for review.